So what we're going to look at here is some basic sail tuning uh, tips, uh, looking at how we can generate the most power from our rig and then how we can control that power. Uh, and we're going to look at what the controls are we can use. We're then going to look at how we apply those controls. So the three main controls we're going to talk about today, uh, we've got the Cunningham, which is just here running up and down the mast. We've got our out hall, which is the red one just below the boom here. And finally, we've also got our kicking strap, which is the one running just here in between our mast and our boom. So what do these controls do? The job of our Cunningham is to pull down on the left of our sail. This pulls the power further forwards in the sail, but also compresses the mast and flattens the sail shape. The role of our outhaul is it tensions the foot of the sail and also decreases the depth of it. The tighter it is, the flatter our sail becomes. And here we're tensioning our kicker, and the role of the kicker is to tension the leech of our sail and control the amount of twist in the sail. Here again, pulling it tighter decreases the twist, easing it increases the twist. So to talk about different wind strengths, so in light winds we're going to be underpowered, we're searching for power to be able to keep our boat sailing. Medium winds, we're powered up comfortably. So we might be sat on the side, we might be hiking, but we are in control and we're maximising the power we can get. And as we move into the strong winds band, we're now starting to become overpowered. We're hiking and we're looking to depower our rig to allow us to remain in control. So here we are in our light wind situation. Start by Cunningham. We've just taken out any excess slack. We're not looking to depower the front of the sail yet. That outhaul, we're going to pull that on very slightly more than normal. With the lack of wind at the moment, we're going to need to help the sail hold its shape. So a bit more outhaul. And finally, the kicker, which is taking any excess slack out so the boom doesn't lift too much, causing the sail to twist. Medium winds now. So our Cunningham, which is going to leave as it was in the light winds, fairly slack. Our outhaul, we're going to ease very slightly now. And the idea is that a bit more belly in the sail will generate a bit more power. And our kicker, fairly similar, just taking up slack. Strong winds, first of all, the Cunningham. We're going to pull that tight and you start to see the sail flattening. The outhaul, again, we're tightening to flatten the sail. And again, as I tighten the kicker, look how the sail flattens to depower itself. As a general rule, when we're going downwind, we can ease all our controls. So the kicker, the outhaul, and finally the Cunningham. This just gives us a bit more shape and a bit more power again. So to recap a few of those key points, a flatter sail generally means less power. A fuller sail will generally mean more power. And please go and play with your boat. Experiment with these controls, see what happens when you do things with them and find what will work for you.